Hi there, Ryan with FlexFireLEDs.com here to show you how to check the voltage of your flex strip LED um, light while it's on. So it's a, it can be important to check your uh, voltage at the beginning and at the end of your of your lengths to make sure that the voltage hasn't dropped too far after installation. Um, so if lights are burning out like that, you can you can see really how much your um, how much your voltage is changing over distance. Also important with uh, running long lines, like um, like if you're running in parallel, let's say, maybe you're not running a uh, large enough wire gauge for the distance that you're running the 12 or 24 volt uh, electricity to the light. So by doing this quick check, you might you're gonna save yourself a lot of headache. So what we did here is we have our uh, voltage meter set to uh, be able to check um, voltage on the lights. I'm going to show one that's not lit so you can actually kind of see it. Right between where you cut the LEDs, so it would be like right here by the gold and then here by the gold, you see there's three LEDs in between. Um, there's the little gold plates, right? Well those are exposed areas for you to put a connector or to be able to take a reading from the LED strip. So just like everything else, red goes to the positive, black goes to the negative symbol, or to the common if there is no negative symbol, so the other side. So I'm gonna get my little my little guys in order here. Take the strip, sorry, it's kinda of tough to see it all at the same time happening. I'll try and line it up so you can see, I have the nodes on the end, I don't know how well you can see it, on the end of the strip, and I'm showing 24 volts. So it just so happens this is our um, 24 volt LED flex strip so it's right where it should be. If it wasn't where it should be um, you might need to consult your electrician or give us an email real quick and see what we can do to work out uh, getting your your voltage to the right to the right number. Keep in mind you are gonna have some voltage drop which is you know it, it's, it's expected but only so much is allowed depending on which um, LED strip you have and the manufacturer so if it maybe isn't through us you need to go find find out what the specs are for your um, for whoever you got it from so I hope this helps and um, you know check us out flexfireleds.com for more information and uh, hope to see you soon bye bye